the Man of the Jedi here on behalf of Horizon to talk about this new clutch chair. So for those of you who don't know, Horizon is now partnered with Clutch Chairs as a company. You can use code Horizon to save 15% off, which is actually a pretty good discount code. So you should definitely go check that out. But today we're going to be doing a little bit of an unboxing. I'm going to put it together. and I'm going to give you guys my initial thoughts and talk about some of the features that the clutch chair has for your gaming pleasure. So without any further ado, let's get into this thing. And we're going to pull this off on three two, and go. Yes. You guys can see that. That is the purple one. I don't know why I want a purple. I'm a huge fan of the green. I really like the orange, the red, the blue. Actually, they all looked really good, but for some reason, the purple was just kind of calling to me. So this is like a neck rest head pillow, which I'm actually really excited for. I have like a lot of neck problems. Like I'm always kind of like cracking my neck. Okay, this I'm really excited about. This is a lumbar pad. I don't know about you guys, but if you're having those long gaming sessions and you're sitting and like just the way that your back curves, it's gonna help you guys have way better posture. I know for me when I'm doing these like long editing sessions or long streaming sessions, like I can be sitting in my chair for, for multiple hours and I know a lot of you guys live that life too. So even something as small as this can actually make just a huge difference, such a huge difference on, on your gaming experience. So we're gonna work on building this. Yeah, so from what I remember, the wheels are actually like a material, it's like a non scuff material so like no matter what you put it on it shouldn't mess up your flooring which is that's a nice touch all right making progress we got it all attached all right so that's all done so i think the last thing we got to do is just put it on the base all right so i think i got it this is me sitting in like the absolute most upright possible position that i could be sitting in it's got this adjuster you can lock that anywhere it's like i can go like all the way back so, you know sometimes those gaming sessions they get so long just want to have a little nap. All right, so today we are going to be completing our review of the clutch chair. So I've had this for about two or three weeks now, so I've really had a chance to use it for multiple different purposes. I've edited in it for hours. I've done multiple weekend streams, like this past couple weekends with the Infinite Warfare beta. This thing has been a lifesaver. I streamed for hours. So I really feel like I got the chance to use this to its full potential. Now let's just take a quick second to go over some of the features before I talk about what I've liked about it the most and how it's kind of changed my gaming. First off, the armrests are fully adjustable. They go up and down, and you can also adjust them so that they're tilted outwards or kind of facing inwards depending on where you kind of keep your hands for gaming. Then on top of that, they move forward and backwards, so you can kind of uh, just kind of pick where is best for you, like where you might lean your elbows, like if you lean forward a lot, if you go right kind of back into the chair, you can have that adjusted completely as you would like, which is really awesome. Now we already kind of touched on this when we were putting the chair together, but you can actually recline to full comfort. You can like, if you're just kind of watching a movie, you can just have this recline, have that neck pillow right there. And as you guys already saw, you can just rotate this thing straight all the way back. Now on top of the recline, you can also adjust the tilt of the chair in general. So there is a lever under the chair that when you lift, see I just kind of jolted forward there. So you could lock it in this position or you can kind of tilt yourself kind of all the way back there, just kind of like how I like it. I almost like it so that it like really seats me right into the chair. So there's like a little bit of an angle. I like it like that, but you can just, you can choose and lock it in place. It's not like you constantly have to be trying to recline yourself back and get to that position and kind of keep your feet, use your feet to kind of keep you in the comfortable position. You can just always be in it, which is obviously super beneficial. Then obviously, of course, you can adjust the height so we can go down. We can go all the way up. I guess the intention would be you would just kind of be where your feet would comfortably sit on the ground, but there's so many different ways that you can have this set up to your own personal level of comfort, to your own desk, to your own setup. There's just, you have unlimited options. So obviously we had already talked about the neck pillow a little bit, and I can say it's definitely a nice benefit to have. I know some people have it so that it's wrapped all the way around here, so it's a little bit higher. I like putting it through the two holes that are actually on the back of the chair, because I feel like that gets it so that it's right at neck level for me, I just move it up a little bit. And then of course, we've got the lumbar pad, which again, you can kind of put this in a couple different spots. I haven't even really been locking mine down. I just kind of shove it in the bottom and I can kind of move it up if I feel like I want it in a different position or if I have my recline set a little bit differently. As you guys probably know, everybody's bodies are a little bit different, so you can adjust these things to different areas on the chair so that they fit your body type a little bit better. Now, I know a lot of you guys are probably wondering, like, Amanda, you seem like a pretty small person. I'm a lot taller than you. I'm a lot wider than you. I, you know, I got, I got the gains. Like, I don't know if I can fit in that chair. And that is where clutch comes in clutch. So if you guys have ever been to the website, you will notice that there are a bunch of different series for the chairs. Just to give you guys an example, this is a Crank Series Echo model. 
Now, if you guys don't know what it means, I'm going to put something up on the screen here, and it'll basically go through what your body type is, how tall you are, how much you weigh, and it'll tell you exactly what model of chair you should get based on your body type. That way you don't have to worry about being like six foot three and trying to fit into a chair that seems like it's perfect for somebody who's five foot five. And then once you find the series that's right for your body type, then that opens up a bunch of different model options so you can pick what's best for you in terms of a series and then what you might like for color and a design. Now the first thing you might notice is that the first day or two that you're using it, you might actually notice some discomfort in your posterior, like, like your butt might hurt a little bit, but I guarantee you that goes away. And the best way to describe why that might happen is that if you're used to these like cushier office chairs, this does have a nice comfortable base where you kind of like sit in and you feel comfortable but it is a lot more firm compared to a lot of other chairs that you might be used to and that firmness is actually a benefit that firmness makes sure that your posture stays a little bit better so that you're more likely to stay comfortable and in a good alignment for longer periods of time while sitting down. I can guarantee that overall I felt better while gaming, while streaming, while doing all sorts of things with using this chair. So basically, if you guys find yourself looking for a new gaming chair, if yours is falling apart like mine was, if it's uncomfortable, if things are poking you, if you just find yourself feeling stiff, uncomfortable with back problems, some soreness in your neck and different areas like that, I would highly recommend looking into a clutch chair. And once again, if you do decide to pick up a clutch chair, make sure you use code HORIZON and save yourself 15%. If you guys have any other other questions about clutch chairs and whether or not they might be good for your setup, feel free to leave them down below. I'll be keeping an eye on the comments just so I can make sure I can answer any questions you guys might have. Links to clutch chairs will be provided in the description down below. They do have different sites whether or not you're in the US, whether you're in Canada, whether you're overseas, so make sure you find the right link for you. As always, Horizon Union would like to thank you for your continued support on the channel. If you guys have not subscribed yet, please feel free to do that today. If you haven't checked out our Twitch channel, that'll be linked down below as well. Feel free to check it out. I've been Amanda the Jedi. Thank you all so much for tuning in and we'll catch you all next time.